I mean, it's a turkey and every single thing you would need for a Thanksgiving yeah. feast. My goodness, Marilyn, you outdid yourself. You sure <laughs> did. It looks delicious. It's incredible, but we want to make sure that if we're going to host Thanksgiving, family, friends, if anyone is willing to take a risk on my house, mm. that we get it right. Mm. <laughs> so your family has been, you know, cooking turkeys to perfection at Zorn's since 1940? Yes. That's an amazing history. Started retail, yeah. Wow. And do you make Thanksgiving dinner or do you just... I actually do. You do? You do. See, I, I would do. think you'd be sleeping after making everybody else's. Right. Yeah, no. I, I know. I get up at 6 in the morning and then put my turkey in the oven, go to work for the day, and then I pull it out when I get back. Okay, we need to know all of your secrets and, and <laughs> tips and you got tricks it. because I want my Thanksgiving to look like this. I love this <laughs> because I feel as though cauliflower is having such a moment. Yes. It's having like a couple of years now where yeah. people are just like really loving on cauliflower. But this is just a little bit of a different take on it, right? It is, it's mashed cauliflower. Okay, so what do you put in that? So it's cauliflower, cream, onions, uh, salt and pepper. And that's it. That's all. And you steam it? That's it. And we steam the cauliflower, yes. Okay. Absolutely. So it's not like a roasted item? No. No. Okay. No. Is that the apple pie? You could eat like it an up apple in the pie. Oven. That, that is, is an apple pie. And then right next to it is yeah. what? That you said is a side it is dish? It's warm cinnamon <gasps> apples, yes. So what do you do? You just. You could just use that as a side. It's, it's like a sweet for. You know, a little bit of sweet, like the cranberry. But like combo. for dinner or for dessert? Yeah, for, dinner. for dinner. For dinner. Yeah. A lot, or if you're carb free, you can have that as. As your dessert. dessert. Yeah. So you or both. Have, yeah. We're not going to make you choose here. <laughs> but we're also going to focus a little bit on the sweet potato. So this is the finished product, right, that people would have. And yours doesn't have marshmallows. Is that the one that has no. it? No. We no, don't okay. have marshmallows, but you yeah. can put marshmallows on it when you get it home. All right. So we are going to be amazing and learn how to make a sweet potato dish. So first up, a big knife. Wait, I'm no. so scared. I'm so scared of using a knife. Like I will go out of my way, like not to use a big knife. I love how Brian, our photographer, is also scared of me with a weapon. Okay, so you did the ends of this one, so that's what needs to happen to the rest of these. Uh, just cut a little off. I mean, if it's gonna go bad, you might as well get it on camera, right? No, that's it. Yes. Yes. Oh, that was good. Okay. That was See? impressive. And that one's already done, so I'm making headway. But what are the things? I mean, obviously these are washed. Yes. Okay. Um, and what else do I need to know when picking out my sweet potatoes? Anything? No? Not really? No. no just, just pick it out, Elizabeth. So Is now, <laughs> you, don't, you don't peel the whole potato. Correct. We leave some of the skin on. Okay. So we do it kind of like every other. And why uh, do you do that? Because I like just, that because it makes it a lot easier. <laughs> it's it's easier, but it's got a, it's, you know, that's where the vitamins are in the skin. Right. And it makes it a little more hearty than, um, you me. know, just... Is there like a right way to peel? I'm scared. Probably I'm not that my, way. My fingers cut off. <laughs> okay, I, yes. I, I peel and like I don't do okay. a continuous motion. So here's the deal. I'm also Her at a weird angle. Look yep. at me. I'm like, yeah. I'm reach sorry. over. No, no. Making a lot of excuses Wait, so for myself, we, Meryl. How do you get the stripe? <laughs> oh, that was a good That's one. It. Am I just That's literally exactly striping it. it? Yep. Yeah. We cut okay. it about four this times. This is a Yankee Wait, sweet need, potato. It's got pinstripes. I need to redeem myself. Let me do a peel. Okay, please. And then you, what I do you do? I can see your mother cringing. I know. Well, you know what? This was not there my job. I did the string beans. <gasps> see, I had the potato oh, peeling job. I was. <laughs> I thought I was the favorite child until right then when I realized I didn't have the best <laughs> job, actually. <laughs> yeah, like that? Yes. So we just okay. try to leave the skin on to make it a little more. All right. Then you harder. chop it, and then you steam them. Now I've tried to steam. It takes forever. To She's steam. like, tell me about it. Eight <laughs> years, Lisa. <laughs> right? Like that, that would take like a lot of steaming, unless you have like a mega. Steam. It does. We have a um, a, a, a combi oven. So, so you it, need it to have a, a lot of time. It does. Yeah. It does take a while to steam. Okay. And then once we do that, we're adding some of these ingredients over here. We have butter. We have sugar? butter, brown sugar. Ooh. I never thought to I add vanilla. Vanilla. I love vanilla. And it's like, so it's good. Everything. Well, that's then, what makes it so. Is, and that, cream. is that cream? Oh, yes. Like cream cream. Like yeah. heavy cream? Oh, that's why it tastes good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we use cream. Yeah, so like skim milk's not going to make it lovely. No. No. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. No, sweet probably be good on the light do. side. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what now? Let's look at the stuffing over there. Do you put it in the bird or you don't? You can, either way. It, it's nice in the bird because it gets all the juices from the turkey, which makes it really, really moist. But either way is perfectly fine. Okay. In my house, we, my mom does one in the bird and one out of the right, bird. Right, because I think people are different, different on that. Yes. Right? Same yeah. thing with the cranberries. Like We have like the, the jar, the canned cranberries, and then we have like the fresh cranberries. Yeah, yeah and, and that one is, on look at the fruit cranberry. in there. That's, that's is fruit that cranberry, cranberry only? No. That's cranberry with fruit in it. And oh. jello. Oh, and jello. Jello. Cherry jello. 
And then the, obviously that's cream spinach. Cream spinach, yes, again, made from scratch. Okay, and then last but not least. Our garlic mashed potatoes. Mm, oh, good. And you roast the actual garlic. We roast the garlic in the oven, yeah. All right, so Elisa and I are now gonna test our turkey trivia in a battle of head to head. I'm grateful that I talked to Meryl before Elisa got here. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> So we love to go head to head. <laughs> so you get to be, I guess, Alex Trebek yeah. right now. Or Lily Salzberg. You get to be Lily yeah. and put us on the spot. How's that? Okay. <laughs> I okay. like to have this job though, asking the questions. Yeah, I know. The I'll pressure's play, on I'll us. Play. All right, so have you ever hosted a Thanksgiving dinner? No. No, okay, me either. So so it would <laughs> never. Yeah. I show up and I bring like the same appetizer every single year. Because you know how to make it. Because I know how to make so that. I know and I run like away. Outside. Yeah, I do <laughs> Okay, what's the first question? How long does it take? How long? <laughs> it's okay. You got it. How long does the turkey need to rest before you slice it? What does that okay. exactly mean? The turkey needs a nap when it comes out of the oven. Did you, did you tell her that? No, really. no, hey, no, 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 you know you're supposed, not supposed to serve it right away. Right, right, right. Okay. <laughs> 30 to 40. I said 20 minutes, but Elizabeth needs 45. <laughs> I need at least I need an, an hour. hour. I need an hour. What's the answer? It's 30 minutes. It's 30. So you cook it. You take it out, you leave it there. You let it sit, yeah. And then you carve it. Yes. Hot. Hot. So, yep. okay. It'll just be a little bit. But not right out of the oven. So exactly. It, needs, okay. it makes it juicier, right? It keeps the juices in it, kind of. But does it still keep on cooking? Like when you take the temperatures, does it still keep on cooking when you take it out? It will no? cook a little bit when you take it. As long as it's not wrapped up, okay. then it really cooks. So it'll uncover still, it. It'll still it cook out, right? a little bit. Okay. okay. Next question. Okay. What is the ratio of stuffing to turkey? Ooh. Oh, man. I think it's this. What do you mean this? This? How much stuffing do you need for the size turkey? Four to one. Okay. I meant like yes. Well, obviously yeah. more turkey than stuffing. I'd like a little bit of turkey with my stuffing. Please. Yes. <laughs> what is it? It is five to one. Yay! All right. Awesome. Okay. Next question. Whew, pressure's on. What is the best way to cook a turkey? Oh, I know. At the store. No, I'm just kidding. Ah, she put oven. <laughs> I'm sorry, I said the question wrong. <laughs> oh, my fire pit outside. The, the oven is great. We know my little steamer is not the way to cook it. Uh, breast down. Is that right? Absolutely. Because you said the breast juices down. then would uh, seep. Okay. <laughs> okay, what's dark. next? <laughs> what size turkey do you buy for your guests? I'm not looking at the answers, it's just a question. <laughs> what size? What size turkey? Oh. How do you oh. figure? Oh, okay, the weight, right? Okay, so it's, oh, you told me this. It's. <laughs> it's 1.5 times the number of guests. Oh, that's a good way to do it. Is that you true? You say each guest is going to eat a pound and a half of turkey? Well, because Rummy. it shrinks, right? It loses a third of a pound of its uh, weight. Okay. Okay, that sounds more normal. And also, I mean, yeah, the cooking. bones have to weigh something, right? Or yeah. not really? Oh, but with yeah. the bones and, and when it shrinks and the bones, it comes out to be about. Uh, okay, do we have one more question or do we win? Uh, the recommended temperature for roasting a turkey. <gasps> oh, okay. So if I'm reheating it from the store, though, it's a different answer. Okay. She just told me that. I think it's this. Oh! I think we have the same I might answer. have overheard this conversation. <laughs> That's the only reason I can't lie. <laughs> You're both right. Yay! <laughs> Thank you, Meryl, so You're much so for coming well. in. Thank you. And creating this beautiful meal. Zorns of Bethpage is amazing. Your family history is fantastic. And thank you for giving us all of your trade secrets. Oh, so you're bringing over the turkey? <laughs> yes. <laughs> thank you. Can we eat? Absolutely. Yes. This is making me really hungry. Let's go.